today is Dr. Tim Bain. Dr. Bain, can you tell us a little bit about your wellness model? It originally started out, my, my dad died from the treatment of heart disease, and I realized that maybe just the way that the medical model was working, which is medication, surgery, that kind of stuff, wasn't enough. Maybe we really needed to look at what's going on with the patient's lives and work on a, maintaining health as opposed to just trying to cure disease. And so that's where it all started. And um, over the past 15 years, we've been kind of developing the model, uh, innovating things to, to include uh, maintenance of health along with disease management. And by doing that, we had to put together a bunch of different practitioners and different types of practitioners from medical doctors to physical therapists to nutritionists to psychologists to uh, neurologically based specialists so that we could look at all the different functions and one of the things that we noticed is that in the, in the healthcare world, a lot of things piecemealed. And if you went to your primary care doctor, they didn't know what the heart doctor was doing. They didn't know what the diabetes doctor was doing. They didn't know what the pain management doctor was doing. And all of these things were causing some of the problems that we were trying to get rid of in the first place. So what we did is we put all those different pieces together so that we can discuss patient care. And so we center everything around the patient. So it's, it, we call it a patient-centered model. And that patient-centered model means that we're gonna look at how do we take that person that now is coming to us sick and bring them back to healthy. And that's a process. It, it, if, you're, if you're really, really sick, um, it's not gonna be adding another medication that gets you well. In fact, a lot of the times when we add another medication, you're gonna get sicker and sicker. So we look at what medications they're on. We look at what's going on with uh, their lifestyle, and we try to take them from where they currently are, moving them over into the health perspective. And we also look at then how do we maintain that. So if somebody's sick, we want to move them over here. If somebody's well, we want to make sure they never end up over into the sick bucket.